Hello, sir. Good evening. I'm very good evening. Hello, Vishnu. How are you? I'm good. How about you? I'm doing good. Okay. Fine. Uh, Vishnu, difference between uh, deployment and daemon set? Daemon set is basically a service that uh, speaks to the API server and uh, user. When you create a daemon set, what happens? When you create a daemon set, uh, basically we can create a replica set. So, what are the types of services you know in a uh, Kubernetes. I know uh, replica set, mm -hmm. deployment, mm -hmm. services, three services, mm -hmm. uh, cluster IP, node port. Yeah, that's all. So, what is cluster IP and what is node port? Uh, cluster IP basically we uh, attach uh, one IP to two ports. For two ports, we attach a single single IP address. We call as a cluster IP. Okay. What is node port? Node port basically if we want to assign any uh, particular port number. For a node, uh, we will assign that. Uh, so sir, node port range. Node port range is uh, thirty thousand to thirty two thousand. Yes, two thousand seven hundred sixty seven. Sixty seven. Kubernetes architecture, please. Yeah, Kubernetes architecture. Yeah, we have uh, uh, four components uh -huh. in a uh, master node and okay. four components in slave node. Uh, four or two? Four. Sure. Yes. Okay. So could you please explain the master components? In master node, we have API server. Uh, API server basically talks uh, all the uh, talks in the microservices mm -hmm. and uh, it will create the infrastructure in uh, microservices and uh, uh, coming to the scheduler, uh, mm -hmm. it will schedule what part should be going to sit on which service, uh, which worker node mm -hmm. and uh, coming to the uh, ETCD, uh, it is uh, basically like a database for a uh, Kubernetes and controller uh, will control all these process processing of a uh, master node. Okay. Yeah. Uh, coming to the slave uh, worker node, uh, we have four components on that. Uh, one is pod, uh, one is uh, kube proxy, and uh, uh, container runtime, container runtime, container D. Uh, we call it as a container D. Uh, if the container is not working, if the image is not working well. Uh, we got to we will get to know by container D. Okay. Have you heard about Podman? Yes, sir. What is the difference between Podman and Docker? Podman uh, is basically very far. Uh, uh, if you want to build our uh, application in Podman, it will build our application in very fastest way. But if we want in security, uh, if we want to uh, uh, build our application with uh, good security, we will uh, choose Docker. Security, Podman, fast, Docker. No, you sorry. told me tell those in the reverse way. That's okay. fine. So, so I Docker architecture. Yeah, Docker architecture. Uh, basically, user uh, will uh, use the commands, uh, Docker commands. By that, daemon uh, daemon will interact with the commands, and it will create image, and it will convert it into container. Converter con con container will be uh, stored in the repository. Okay. What is the command to build a Docker container? Docker uh, Docker create hyphen app, Do Docker run Docker run hyphen hyphen name uh, our our application name and uh, um, Nginx uh, colon latest or else uh, whatever the version we want to take. Okay, you passed out here. Uh, 2021 sir. 2021. Yes. From 2021 to 2024, there are three years. Yes. Tell me what you have done. I have worked as a um, analyst. Initially, I have started my career in teleperformance as an analyst in ML, and I switched to another company, which is a current time period. One year, from three. first year to second year. One year, three months. Okay. And I switched to another company, uh, working uh, till now. Till now. Yes. And once you got an opportunity with AWS, and you also switched that second company, also, right? Yes. Uh, why are you frequently changing your company? Um, Why Tele performs to this company, second company? What is the reason behind that? Uh, basically, I want to uh, I want to face uh, challenges in my career so that I'm I'm going through multiple companies and get multiple uh, what are roles the and roles. You now gain knowledge from Tele performance to the second company. What are the roles? Both are same. No, different. What is the first role? Is analyst. Analyst. Okay, and the second one is support engineer. Support? Support engineer. Support engineer. Yes. Your qualification? BBA. BBA? Yes. Okay, okay. 
MBBA to the support engineer, what, you, what are the roles in this? Um, I'm working as a uh, support engineer. As of now, we have we don't have any project. I'm working. I have trained as a support engineer uh, in service now for ticketing tool. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But you don't have any project. Ah, uh, we don't have. Then any. what are the challenge you faced? Yeah, how the IT people will work on a uh, project, and uh, how the uh, client will uh, uh, approach uh, for their requirement. And I I don't even know. But given an opportunity. Okay. What is your current CTC? Three point six. Three point six. Yes. Then I'll give you only two point five. And how many months you'll survive here? I will get an opportunity to to learn in DevOps. Get to gain an opportunity uh, to learn uh, knowledge in DevOps. I will uh, make sure I will be serving for your company at least two years. Great. Thank you, Vishal.